Helping you live healthy. New research reveals that GLP-1 drugs like Ozembic may reduce the risk of cancer. The findings were recently published in the Journal of American Medical Association. Researchers found evidence that the use of the semaglutide medications help reduce the risk of obesity-associated cancers in people with type 2 diabetes. News Jack's reporter Tiffany Salome dug into the research after speaking with a local doctor about the findings. We still don't know how they work. So that's the interesting part. Dr. Hussein Abbas is talking about semaglutide. It's the key ingredient in popular weight loss drugs like Ozempic, which is now linked to a reduced risk of some cancers. So what I've seen is I've seen um, a lot of maybe sensationalist or, um, articles or research studies coming out. You know, some vilify the medication and some kind of like tell you this is almost like the next nirvana. Um, I think it's neither. I think that the, the area is in the middle, especially if somebody like me who deals with this almost every day. As a bariatric surgeon who specializes in weight loss, we asked him for his take on a new study by JAMA suggesting that drugs like Ozempic can lower cancer risks by up to 65%. There are a few caveats. So somebody with specialty in this who looks at this paper, they found no difference between the GLP-1s and metformin, which is a fraction of the price of the GLP-1. So this paper actually raises more questions. Researchers studied 13 cancers linked to obesity using the electronic medical data of more than 1.6 million patients. They found a reduced risk in 10 types of cancers for people with type 2 diabetes using GLP-1 drugs, including gallbladder, ovarian, and colorectal cancer. Semaglutide was not linked to a significantly reduced risk of developing thyroid, stomach, or breast cancer. So you think that this research kind of highlights the health risks of obesity? Absolutely. There is no doubt. We actually, I mean, paper after paper after paper has come out and basically said, Obesity, if you think of the human body or you think of like the disease conditions, um, like leaves on a tree, mm -hmm. obesity is a trunk. Obesity almost feeds every single one of these. It feeds, we do know gastrointestinal diseases. We know that it, it's associated with some colorectal diseases, malignancy specifically, diabetes, gallbladder, sleep apnea, osteoarthritis. People like Stephanie Paris, who's lost 35 pounds using semaglutide, say the newly found health benefits are not surprising. I am at an increased risk for things like colorectal cancer and that kind of stuff. So seeing the article that you sent me, you know, just kind of affirmed that I made the right decision doing that for a little over a year. I, everybody can knock on it all they want, but really it's it helps you in so many different ways, not only in your lifestyle, but also those health factors, you know? So it's, it's huge. Tiffany Salome, Channel 4, the local station.